Hello everyone, this is Dr. Enemy Johnny here, and in today's video, I'm not going to talk with this, but talking in my regular voice, this is, I'm recording the intro, <clears throat> I'm recording the intro after I almost finished the video, so, enjoy this video, and get on with the intro. <laughs> Gonna start. <sighs> Amazing digital circus. I don't know why I'm making this video, but it's the 31st. I'm probably gonna upload it sometime like next week. So, second video of the new year, I guess. Anyway, lower. But I'm not. watching it again and I thought it was a couple things but um remember when I made that other video other war video um back last year about VR headsets and yeah oh, I don't know but actually why does King only has why does everybody else has like full on like faces and everything when Kane only has So now we're gonna talk about the says another human has appeared in shirt or in NPC, but but apparently the humans are trapped in this digital circus. By the way, I'm bad at theory videos. Check the other one, like I said. Like, like, like the other one. Anyway, the humans are apparently humans are trapped in this digital circus via headsets. But as Matt, as Matthew Patrick, aka Matt Pat, said, copy the minds of the people wearing the headsets and this, the, and that. <laughs> yeah, but. Um, This is VR headset, and then just there. But this is, and this is another human, but I don't know if Matt is correct or not. But he, this is a, a theory video. This is also a theory video. So, um, if humans are trapped in this digital circus, and um. Also, also like crazy really crazy humans I didn't say that earlier but yeah no not everyone but um Ragatha I guess um 
get out so well. It's um probably a worker or just probably a headset and it's trapped there with the other workers or developer co workers technically but yeah. Or just you like one of the first people that like finish the game, to finish the game and that finish that and just appear there after. Um, that is fantastic. A fantastic question for myself. I just questioned myself, but anyway, I'm making this video short so I can actually upload it today. About the abstraction or abstract, I don't know what like the word is for that, but um, it's like going person goes so crazy, super crazy, and then just how that works, goes super crazy, and then just turn to a blob like from front and half or whatever, kind of similar. No, it's just abstract, go crazy for an exit like cough mode did. What is is it possible for like person to like go like care to go back to regular or it's just person that I abstract just stays abstract forever because later. You see, when Cain, um, Cain app sends Kofflo down to the, to, I forgot what you called it, to like, there's multiple abstracted cared people, so, I don't think people, they can turn back to regular, to regular people, or characters, because, yeah, if it was sent, if it was sent down to the pit. Some, yeah, I I am running out of ideas right now. Wait, also, 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 why do the characters go like start like Ragatha? Start glitching out like crazy after cough mode like attack Ragatha. Then when Rag, no, see when Ragatha reached out to, well, finally reached out to Ragatha, and started glitching. So, um, how does that how is that supposed to be? So abstract person. Person, like, encounter. Wait, hold on a second. Like, when an abstracted person attacks a non abstract person, they start glitching out. What happens if Kane didn't fix Ragtha? What, what would have happened? Would Ragtha start? I know Rex will probably still be click glitching out, but Rack will Rack at those going insane, trying to try to always keep herself from not going insane. But when she started just glitching out, ah, that that is a um, I have no idea actually. My pet can probably end up make another video on this. Or oh, on the Amazing Digital Circus. Covering that. It's also when. Like, when Tommy saw the workspace. He just, like, zoomed, just zoomed into like one specific desk. And he starts going crazy. 
the Joker, but why does he start tricking out? Like, was it that her, um, that her desk when she worked on this game? Because it's like no people at the tape at the at the workspace. And plus, the VR headsets are just sitting there at the desk on the table. So how can it be VR if the headsets are still there? That doesn't that doesn't work. Is it is it like the character? Sorry, I'm not here. Is the is the person that was working on the game or show or whatever thinks it is game? I don't. I'm not sure. But anyway, if the person that was working on this like, put on the headset, their like whole entire like body just goes in the headset and was if the pet did it'll be, it'll be on the floor of the chair, right? And not just somehow it's back on the table or the desk. But that's for Matt Pat to figure out. Me, I'm just a just a regular guy on the thirty first making a video on this, but yeah, and like Matthew Patrick said in his second making Joel circus video, it's like the last supper painting. I was created like a while ago. And it was like very similar to the ending of this pilot episode. You can just hear it from Matt Pat himself. I'm gonna leave the link in the I'm trying to find the link in the present description or just the end of the video. Gonna make another outro for this video specifically. So Hear Matt, hear Matt Pat about this. So the claim that the digital circus is literally hell is a pretty bold one. So why would I possibly make it? Well, look at this. At the very end of the pilot, here we're shown all the human characters sitting at a table while eating food. But you notice anything weird about their dining arrangement? Of all the ways they could have set up this table, they decided to have every character on just one side. All of them facing the same direction, out at us, the audience. When this is done in fiction, it's rarely by mistake. Because this right here, this is a very iconic framing device from one of the most famous paintings paintings ever made, The Last Supper by Leonardo da Vinci. This depicts the final meal of Jesus and his followers shared before his crucifixion. It's been the backbone of conspiracy theories and Dan Brown novels for centuries. Gooseworks, creator of the series, and all the other creatives over at Glitch, they're smart people. They wouldn't be using this imagery without understanding the historical baggage that comes along with it. And it's- Thank you guys for watching comment. Well, well actually, this isn't the video I was just joking about. Um, that going queen bro that's supposed to be a snake or something because i i don't know I'm just, I'm just wondering if that's supposed to be a snake or just some random creature just for this because i've never seen anything like that anyway on to the out on to the end of the video now like actually well this is technically the end of the video but in the end of the video this video was quick more like my intermittent reviews, but I'm probably gonna review this pilot episode like next week or um or Friday. This video is going to be out today. It's Sunday. Making this video, I'm probably gonna upload this video six o'clock in like four hours ish, depending on how long it takes me to edit this video. And how long to make the thumbnail and upload this video to YouTube and keep it on private until I actually upload it. But anyway, comment, like this video, and subscribe if you feel like it. Um, but when I'm making this video, I'm at 205 subscribers. Thanks for that. Well, it took me seven months. When I hit 100 subscribers, 
200 subscribers. That's crazy. But, um, Happy New Year. I mean, just to let you know, another video coming out on at literally midnight when I, for, for me, it's midnight. I don't know. But I don't know about other people. Like, y'all, I don't know what y'all. But me, it's midnight. Midnight in less than 10 hours or 9 9 hours and 40 40 minutes so yeah enjoy this special and outro even though I have to make another intro for this video too yep later